Hi, welcome to uh, this particular video which is going to be on bearings. Now, this is um, high school maths, um, it usually occurs round about, um, let's say, round about GCSE level in the UK and it's usually pitched at about a grade C, something like that. Um, the only thing really you need to remember with bearings is that it always goes right. What I mean by that is that you've got um, usually something like this and it says a point is due north and it, typically they use a sailing ship or something like that and what they'll say is is that that sailing ship is heading on a bearing of 065 so 065 and what they mean by that is that it's just simply using a standard protractor and uh, I hope you can see that okay but all we're going to do is um, if you see from the protractor there I've actually marked that in at 065 from the protractor um, so it's just really a case of working when you're working with bearings at working with angles and you need to be quite accurate so you need to make sure you've got a sharp pencil and also a protractor and a compass as well usually okay so let me give you a an example of a question which I'm going to write into the comments box below the description box below you can have a look at it and um, I hope it'll be useful it's going to be something like this so you've got uh, in this particular case we've got two ships um, we've got ship A and also we've got over here um, ship B okay and um, the question is um, to locate and draw the position of ship C which is somewhere in the middle and the things that you're given is that ship C is on a bearing of 065 degrees from ship A the other thing that you're given is that uh, ship C is also on a bearing of 290 degrees from ship B. So in other words, if we look at ship A, so if you imagine that you're standing on the deck and you're facing north, and what we're going to do is we're going to plot a line from A at 065 degrees. So again, just use the protractor and you've got 065 degrees which goes like that. So 065 degrees. So in other words, if you're standing on the deck of ship A and you look across at 065 degrees, you're going to see ship C somewhere along that line. So the other thing is, is that the information we're given is 290 degrees from ship B. Well okay, um, with all bearings they always go right. So what we're going to do is plot 290 degrees right. So it's going to be something like over there and that's going to be 290 degrees from ship B. And again we would plot the line up something like that and where those two lines cross that would be the location of C. Okay, I hope that's okay for you. Just a very quick tip on this. Um, what I've got is a standard um, uh, semicircular type protractor. So if I imagine, the difficulty I've got is that I can't really go right and plot that 290 degrees because the protractor will only let me get to the very bottom, which is 180 degrees. And if you look at the protractor, it'll say, zero through to 180 degrees at the bottom there. So in other words, I can achieve 180 degrees, but I've got to get around to 290. Well, what I do is I know that the difference between 290 and 180 degrees is 110. So what I do then is I just add 110 onto this here so that this bit here is actually 110 and this bit here is actually 180. Put the two together and you've got 290 all the way around. Um, I hope that's been useful. Please do add a comment below. Please do uh, post, pin, tweet, subscribe to this particular video and I look forward to seeing you next time.